Welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We've just recently entered the restricted arc territory. So everybody's going to shoot us if they see us. And our goal at the moment is just to head deeper into arc. Looks like there's a bit of a security checkpoint here. Camera, a couple laser grids. So that's one floor below us. We're just a little bit up here. So it's pretty close to where we are. Yeah, something I think I should do here, by the way. Um, I have one Praxis. Something that I think would be very useful, now that we have so many enemies around us, is I can do an, a radar upgrade. This one will make it so that the cone of vision for enemies appears on the minimap, like it shows right here. I think that would be super useful. Oh yeah, that is really Nothing nice. Happening in the LQ. How can we ignore the police? Could one of them have done it? You think? The police will not be happy until they have Talos in custody. So there's only this one person up here. How do I turn the safe off again? You're the first line of defense. Ooh. Someone left all the showers running again. I think I'll be okay doing this. I don't think they'll see. Ah, we're good. I'm just gonna throw your body. Uh. Uh. Oh my god! We need to be ready in case the police make a push. That looks so ridiculous. And also, that's way further than I wanted to throw them. I wanted to throw them onto soft grain, not all the way down here. Are you still alive? Yeah. Yeah, they're they're fine. Okay, cool. Wow. It's like they planked in midair while I threw them. Yeah, there's a lot of verticality here, so there's a lot of people that could potentially see me from up above. What should we do about the police? I'm, I'm considering that maybe I shouldn't explore everything. I don't know, I get the strange feeling that maybe I can get on Rucker's good side, and then maybe they would kind of accept me as one of them and allow me to explore around. I don't know, maybe it's kind of unlikely, but it's just this place is really big. And my mission is just to head right here to go further in, so I feel like I should just go with that and see what happens. Or I could laboriously take every single one of them out. Ooh, exercise ball. So orbular. Right, so I'd like to avoid going directly into that security checkpoint if I can. Um, I don't know what else I could take, though. There's an elevator here? Where does that elevator go? Goes up to floor four. Which could take me to the dormitory, and then I could go down the dormitory to the gymnasium. That would not be helpful. Hmm. I could maybe go up to level seven. That could be helpful. I'm, I'm really not sure. This place is so big. <laughs> it's funny the way that I'm Jensen just pops up. All stiff. Hmm? 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 The police will not be happy until they have Talos in Like a meerkat or something. I'd like to go up rather than down. Like over there, there's something up there. How would I get across though? There's a lot of people down there. Could make a distraction, I suppose. Uh, 
Let's just go down for now, see where see where this takes us. We will have a lot to do once the police leave. Jensen, how's it going down there? Still working my way through the living quarters. Picking out a place for you and the missus? <laughs> I could see it now. You settling down, Nothing. growing a great rusty beard, raising a few toasters. She take her out on the road, she came. What's that? You're cutting out. Distraction would be really nice right about now. Uh oh. Come on, go check it out. Please don't come around the corner. Please don't come around the corner. It's clear. There's nothing. Seriously. Could one of them have fall over um okay okay we're, we're good right now that's not to say we're gonna be good for a long time though because there's a lot of people patrolling look at all these things i could select in my quick bar it's not so quick anymore it's all overcrowded jensen how's it going down there I'm still working my way through the living quarters picking out a oh, place for you and the missus <laughs> i could see it now you settling down Growing a great rusty beard, raising a few toasters. She take her out on the road, she can. What's that? You're cutting out. You know as well as I do. I think there's some other people over watching too that I need to keep an eye out for. They might be too far away to actually see them. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna get to Talos Rucker, and they're gonna be like, Get out of here! I'll call my guards on you. They call their guards, and literally, like, all 50 of them are asleep. Okay, so yeah, we have some more. You can see them on the map, but I think they're pretty far up there. Or over there in the gymnasium. I mean, this wasn't too hard to do. Maybe I should just... Maybe I should just explore this place and try to take them all out. I have so many Trank darts. Whoa. Oh, this is a gorgeous room. I love the ambiance. Just like a total chill out room. Play some chess, play some cards. Ew, there's cockroaches all over the place. Ooh, hello. Seven the floor storage room B security code. Um, yeah, blah 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 security code. Okay. Whoa. I don't know. There's got to be a name for that, like art constructed out of the lines of polygons. I don't know. It's like polygonal art. Really cool. Not sure exactly what it is. That's obviously a face up there. It's kind of like a humanoid structure. That's really cool. Even that broken mirror looks like art. Maybe it is. Why would they call them 
They might be suspicious if I open this door. Yep. everyone. Level 2 storage room A, security codes, all sorts of security codes I'm getting. wonder how far I can throw you. Eh. Just a little slide across the ground. So satisfying. I was just gonna head straight there, but this is way better. I have so much ammo, it's finally time I use it, huh? They could find the person truly responsible for the bombing if they wanted to. Is that a wrestling ring? doing push-ups. <laughs> Maybe they'll just wake up and be like, ah, oh, I just pushed myself too hard. I just passed out while doing push-ups. No, I think they'll know what happened though when they find that huge dart that's <laughs> stuck in their cheek. <laughs> oh. oh, this game is so much fun. Yeah, once again, why is that highlighted? It must be destructible. Maybe if you shoot it with, you know, a destructive gun. Or weapon of some sort, maybe it would... I don't know. I mean, it's obviously a power block, so it would... Disable some stuff, maybe? Or maybe just cause, like, an electrical explosion? I love watching him fall asleep. Bleh. There's not too many left, huh? Just three. <laughs> oh. oh, look at th this is so cool. It's like a makeshift, I mean, I don't even know what the hell this machine is called, but it's some sort of an exercise machine. It's like a makeshift exercise machine. They reuse, like, uh, I think these are parts of, a uh, of wheels? For, like, the weights? That's the counterweight, and you pull down on this bar. And I guess that's the seat made out of tires or something? That is so cool. Yeah, this gymnasium is sweet. Just all sorts of makeshift exercise equipment. Oh, I've gotten so many passwords, I thought I'd have the password to this. Oh, showers. 
I don't know why everything just turned on, though. Seems like a bit of a waste of water. It's so steamy in here, I love it. Is this a punching bag? Except it's not even a bag, it's a fridge, I think. Well, I guess if you have augmented arms, I, I guess maybe that wouldn't hurt you. If you don't, though, ouch. Ooh, out of room. Is there anything I want to dump? It's all pretty good stuff. Yeah, I think I want to keep it all. Fall. More violence will only escalate. I'm really impressed with how much work they put into this environment. It's super detailed and so different from everything else, and just everything is just like ingenious improvisation to make a gymnasium and make a place to live. I have no idea where I'm going. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Ooh, frag grenade. Uh, so I definitely want that so I can move heavy objects out of the way. Okay, I'm just gonna... Let's just dump a weapon like the tactical shotgun. It's not worth that much. Security rating four. Oh, God. missed you. Gotta get my 135 credits. I've got 30,000 credits now. Okay, out of curiosity, what if I just like... Uh, nah, alright. If it's destructible, you need an actual explosive. I can't make the fuse box go to sleep. There's small exercise balls and there's big ones. Let's take out these two people over here. Last two ones left, right? Yeah. Do you ever think about how unfair Oh, that makes him suspicious. Yeah, that makes sense. The police must realize they're overreacting.
All oh, right, got the free run of the place pretty much. Let's just loot, loot, loot. So this leads to what? Oh, I'm in the dormitory. Leads to a hallway with some high security. Um, a lot of ways to go from here. Elevator, stairs, ladder. Let's make sure I've gotten every... Whoa, look at those lights. That is so cool. It's like this futuristic polygonal wireframe-ish kind of lump. Oh. Huh. That could be helpful. But yeah, I haven't explored down here too well, have I? Or no, down here, rather. So this is the gym and did I go in this shower, or is this a different shower? Yeah, I've been in this one. I think it's more down downstairs, like down here, that I have, really haven't explored. Oh, already been there. Yeah, let's get out of the gymnasium. Oh. Where's this? Access granted. Oh, it's a it's a library. There's some more people out here. Oh yeah, quite a few. Two there, two up there, three up there actually. Ooh. And they are... Yeah, they're actually overwatching this place. They're just exposed. Uh, I don't think I want to shoot them. They would instantly notice and I'd probably lose sight of the other one. Can I just use this elevator? Yeah, it looks like it. That's the main security checkpoint. Oh. These two are in, uh, yeah, in the security checkpoint. Um, hmm. The way they're facing is very inconvenient. Oh, that didn't make them suspicious. Ah, I used to tell her that things were difficult, but we were making progress. Lately, though, she doesn't ask anymore. Okay, this is... Oh, man. I didn't expect him to come. Oh, shit! We're good? Yeah, yeah, we're good. Okay. Whew. Oh, shit. Oh, it's a security cam. All right, let's let's just turn that off. Didn't trigger, thankfully. Camera off. Laser grid off too. doctor's room. I really am disturbed by the amount of unrefrigerated blood packs. Maybe the blood packs of the future are just like self-refrigerated. 
I can only hope. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Uh, we changed all the codes, remember? 100 emails about it, blah blah blah, there's a code. Remember to delete this email. Of course, you can count on me. <laughs> Good job, Vlad and Malik. Ah, from Talos Rucker. Gentlemen, I know this has been a difficult and trying time, but that is no excuse for the crass sensationalism in last week's video address. The members of ARC here and around the world expect the best from me, and I give it. We are not Pikus. We are a force for truth. In the future, I expect 1. More vigorous and efficient fact-checking 2. Extra care to my microphone placement There is a lot of proximity noise, uh, noise from the lavalier microphone you used Number 3. A complete and total elimination of any and all jump cuts We have three cameras. If you feel you need to edit out some dead space, please cut to cameras 2 or 3 in the future. I appreciate your acquiescence and attention to these notes. I recognize that times are difficult, but presentation and public perception are vital to us, now more than ever. Yeah, so they're very savvy about how they come across. How they're perceived. Victor Marchenko, brothers and sisters, when I ask for security reports or for something to be cleaned or for shipments to be delivered or unpacked, I am tired of hearing the question, is this urgent? Everything is urgent. That is the price of the little freedom we have. And if you do not like it, take a good look at the way the rest of Golem lives. Don't ever ask me this again. Holy crap. Supplemental newsletter. This is big. Um, I guess I'll skim it. Uh, start at the top. Addressing citizens of the Utilec Complex. In light of the recent tragic events in Prague, I wish to keep everyone as up-to-date as possible. So for the next little while, ARC will be issuing these supplemental newsletters as required. Okay. Since the Rizga train station bombing, the police presence in Utilek has increased. I've heard numerous reports of violations of civil liberties. While it's understandable that emotions are running high, there's no excuse for this abusing of innocent people. Um... Strongly advising the citizens of Utilek to also show restraint, not be violent. Be courteous to the police, cooperate with them. For all members of ARC. Um, our bi-weekly food shipment has been delayed one full week. In order to stretch out our supplies while still being able to donate to those outside of ARC who have less access to food than we do, I will be limiting myself to half rations until the next shipment, and I encourage every healthy member of ARC to do the same. Privileges of leadership must be balanced with an equivalent willingness to make sacrifices. Uh, all members of the Committee for Health and Environment, there will be a joint meeting on Saturday to discuss the recent grey water epidemic. Grey water epidemic, what is that? Is that related to the water epi- That must be the water ep epidem bleh, epidemic that we dug up dirt on that Picus News was covering up. Let's see. I'm sent to report the assassination uh, in St. Petersburg of Nadia Pavlova, a tireless crusader for human rights in Russia and the world over. Augmented citizens of St. Petersburg and Moscow are now rioting in protest of her murder. And also saying we should they should not be using violence, urging them to not use violence. And a final word. People might be tempted to give up hope. Please continue to treat your neighbor, augmented or otherwise, as you yourself would prefer to be treated, and remember that through patience, diligence, and remaining firm in our principles, we will see a brighter future. Okay. Yeah, I mean, they seem super honorable. Yeah, they definitely did not do the terrorist bombing, but I definitely think, uh, what was their name? Machenko? Marchenko. Victor Marchenko. That person is more into violence. Let's 
Is that a mine? Mine template. Still don't even know what those are for. I have a hunch, but I've never checked it out. My hunch is that maybe you use your spare parts to, like, craft it. Maybe you combine a mine template with a grenade. Could that be it? Ooh, we gotta test this. I'll dump, like, I don't know, this pilsner. So, can we take something like a frag grenade? Yeah, you can combine it with the mine template. Cool. I don't know if I actually want to do that, though. What? I mean, I guess... Um, well, I've already got a gas mine. I guess I could make another one. Uh, hello? Wait, what? It's highlighting it like it can do it, but... I, I click on it and nothing happens. Alright, whatever. It's theoretically possible. Okay, so we've been to the gymnasium, we've explored... Uh, we haven't really explored this part of the commissary. There's our good buddy in there. Ooh! Pocket secretary. Uh, another passcode. I'm interested in what's in this building specifically. Oh! Oh, it's this one! Yeah, it leads over to the gymnasium. Okay. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So we've kind of conquered the uh, ground floor here, and a little bit up too, around the gymnasium area and the commissary and all that. Completely ready, disabled all security to pass through this area. So I can either do that, or just head up more. And, oh wow. Pretty. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.